For many beginner as well as advanced web developers, it is often a struggle to just make a quick markup or quick uh, prototype of a design that you are proposing. For people just learning, it is always useful to first learn HTML itself, which is the structure of a website, as well as then this cascading style sheets, which are used to present how the website will look. Well, many people often fall back onto templates which they already used or which they acquired. But sometimes you might sit with a client or just for yourself and just want to do a quick prototype drawing up of how you would like your website to be. Well, I found a new tool which fits in the middle and creates, makes it really easy for you to create quick prototypes. If you go to the website drawto.com, you will be presented with this interface. What makes it great is you can firstly decide how big your canvas is that you want to use and then it makes it easy for you to draw specific elements on the web page that you propose. So what we'll do is we will draw a page wrapper, what we'll call, then often you will have something like a header, Okay, we might also have a sidebar and we might have a main content area. Okay. If we wanted to, we could also put another sidebar here on the side, which might even go all the way to the top. Okay. You see that these are called different nodes, and the beautiful thing about Drawter is it allows you to go and rename these and give them the real attributes as you would get in your final code. So page wrapper, apply that, we will do one for the header. Let's give it a name of header, apply that. We can also go here for sidebar. And so forth. You also have complete access to the cascading style sheets where you can decide which font family you'd like, what type of text, what type of borders, if it's gonna have borders, margins, paddings, all the CSS that you're used to writing by hand. Additionally, you can also provide backgrounds. You can also change the background color just to make it easier for you to see. Okay. And what is really good is after you've set up everything, you have the opportunity to select sizes. So it creates the sizes for you. In edit mode, you can always resize these. And lastly, you generate code. Now this code, is the code that you can copy and paste into a developer tool such as Dreamweaver or Coda if you're on Mac or Composer which is another free tool. This way you end up with really really good markup for your web page. You, you end up with cascading style sheets which are both or either inline or external and is a really really quick and dirty well not dirty but quick quick way for you to create mockups and um, I find it extremely useful. It, from me, it gets a 5 out of 5 for tech geekiness and uh, ease of use. So that is Drawter. I hope you enjoy it.